Hey guys and girls, welcome back to another beautiful video on this beautiful channel, on this beautiful day. How you guys and girls are doing? Hope you're doing great as always. Uh, we haven't made a video uh, for this game for a little while since there's been so much shit I, I had to do and the new series and everything, but I really appreciate the support. And for those of you who follow this one, um, I'm going to try to just keep working on it slowly but surely. But feel free to add your own features and everything as, as you go along. Uh, but before we get started, please check out the uh, the description box, uh, all the nice links. Also, drop a like, subscribe if you like the content. So let's get going. We added some type of a some type of a what do you call it? Um, randomization to the items. One thing I forgot to add in armor.cpp is the armor type. Okay, so I'm thinking type. Okay, so I'm thinking I'm just going to print that out here. This get armor type as string. Uh, and then, yeah, that should, that should pretty much uh, let us get the armor type as well. So that's cool. Now, there's a bunch of things I want to do in this game, but I think I'd focus on a new type of thing today. Uh, and that is a way to heal the character while you're fighting. So if we're at character CPP, I'm just going to close all other documents. I'm just going to open character CPP and character H. And I'm going to add a few things. Um, gold. Flasks. Okay, so I'm going to add flasks. And I did that in my other series as well. Uh, but I, I like that system. So I want to be able to heal my character as I'm fighting. And for that, we're going to need a int flasks okay int uh, max or oh, int flasks i guess zero is the least uh, int max flasks okay shards max flask shards okay so we'll get flask shards and then we'll combine them into flasks and then we can use the flasks okay um so that is good. That is good. Int flask upgrade level. Flask level. Let's just call it flask level. Okay, so now we got a bunch of nice little uh, variables that we're going to use. So flask level is going to decide how much uh, a flask heals. Um, then how many flasks and how many flask shards you have and everything like that. So let's just use this. Go ahead, go into CPP. And at the bottom here, I'm just going to put those back. I'm just going to remove all the ints here. Okay, I'm just going to write this here instead. So I use Shift and Alt to kind of do this. I just hold down Shift and Alt and you can select everything, all right? So flask level, one. Flasks, let's say we start with uh, two flasks, okay? Max two. Flash shards zero, max flash shards uh, ten, I guess. So there you go, there you go. Now we need ways to print this out. Uh, so when I'm saying, when I'm getting stats. I'm doing the two string short kind of string equipped. Okay, okay, okay. Mm, probably gonna use this. So we get all the equipped stuff, uh, and we got all this. Then probably I'm gonna use flasks here. flasks like this and then we're just going to do this flask flasks uh, this flasks max flasks there we go okay and a new line god damn it dude okay there we go then we're going to 
kind of copy paste all that uh, flask shards flask shards flask shards max flask shards okay that's cool um, I'm wondering how did I name everything else max mana max HP max okay so the max should be sorry about this just change the max to be afterwards okay shouldn't be too hard small f flasks max okay so that that makes more sense then we'll go up here we'll just change that real quickly flasks max and then flask shards max okay boom all right now we're good um flasks max flask shards max there we go and then okay we print that out uh what else do we have we had the flask level as well um i'm just going to do another new line just to end that flask come on dude flask level new line this flask level okay so there we go all right all right all right so now we're printing all this out not a semicolon there i'm just going to copy this whole thing and i'm going to go into character.h oh no character.cpp still just close this down and then we're going to get get menu bar so i want to print this into the menu bar and this is for show attributes and all that stuff. That's cool. Um, so we got stat points, stamina. Let me just, for now, let me just comment out stamina. Um, and I'm going to do this. Um, copy one of these. Actually, I didn't need to copy the other one. I can just copy one of these lines. And then do this. And then we're going to do... A nice little combination of everything flasks okay this flasks um, like this and then one of these all right this flasks mm, flasks max all right, and then we're probably going to do a L level level like that. This flask level. Okay, so now this is getting really complicated here. So flask level, do one of these. Okay. Um, LV. Shards. I guess we could do it this way. Um, shards. I don't know what would look best, but let's just do this. This flask shards. This flask. This flask shards. Whoops. This is kind of tedious, I know. It's max. Okay. And then we're going to do the ending parentheses here. Like that. Hopefully, hopefully this looks somewhat presentable. So let's just run this. And we'll get the level and the shards. Okay, I, I guess, I guess, I guess that looks okay. So level 1, shards 0 out of 10. Flash 2 out of 2. That looks that looks fine, and we don't have stamina anymore. So that's uh, that's all right. 
that's okay. Um, all right, so now once we got that working, we're gonna go into character.h and we're going to go into functions and we're gonna do a bunch of uh, void void reset flask, okay. Um, and then we're gonna do void upgrade flask void consume flask all right so we've got a bunch of functions here for the flask uh, so we got the reset upgrade and then consume and how would we how would we level up the flask though We'll we'll get to that later. We'll just let's just com complete these first. So reset flask, upgrade flask, and consume flask. So we'll just keep those right now. There we go. Um, go back in here. All right. This flasks. This flasks. Max. Upgrade flask. If. This shards. Flash shards, very cool to this. Flask shards max. Shards max. This flask shards minus equal to this flask shards max. All right, so we're just gonna remove 10 uh, flash shards from flash shards. All right, so then then we'll do that, and we'll do this. This flasks max plus plus. All right, so we just upgraded how many we can hold, and then gy message alert flask increase increase number of flasks increase number of flasks system pause i guess um we could use a bool in here if we don't want to use system and everything so we'll just set that to bool and not use this right now okay so boolean and this is boolean as well then so consume and upgrade should be booleans. Boolean, boolean, boom, boom, boom. Okay, cool. Good shit. Um, and then you just create a bool. Upgrade equals false. All right. Upgrade equals true if it was successful. And then we'll just return upgrade. And pretty much just copy the whole thing here paste it in here all right consume is the boolean's name now and if this flasks greater than zero then this flasks minus minus and pretty much pretty much that i'm just going to use the yeah, we can we can do that. Let's do minus minus first here. Okay. So if there are flasks to consume, you'll consume them, and then that's about it. So no no big deal. Um, we just need to do this. This reset HP. All right. So there you go. So we set the HP as well. That's the most important part. Uh, and there you go. Cool. So now we can use the flasks and everything in the next video. I'm just gonna make sure we can uh, we can use them from the from the menu, from the combat menu and stuff. So uh, yeah, that's gonna be pretty cool. But yeah, thanks for watching. I hope that was cool. Take care. Check out the description box and, and thanks for all the support. All right, I really appreciate it. And I'll see you guys and girls in the next one. All right, bye bye.